How's it going, guys? Two Foot Giant back again. I'm going to go ahead and uh, finish up the Helios line. So this will be amber and gold. I'm going to do amber first. Honestly, I just got a wild hair up there and decided to go in alphabetical order. Um, <laughs> so amber is supposed to be a banana parfait. I'm not going to lie, look at the level in the bottle. I've been vaping this for about two hours trying to get the flavor. Um, banana is one of those ones that I find extremely difficult for me to taste. Um, it's just like uh, it, bananas, custards, and vanillas. I have a really hard time tasting. So if I can get the custard out of it, if I can get the banana out of it, if I can get the vanilla out of it, then it might be too strong for you, or it might be just spot on to what you're wanting. This, however, I get a whole lot of the cream. I can taste what seems like, like a ladyfinger. What I'm getting more out of this quite honestly seems like a tiramisu without the darker ingredients. The lady fingers and the cream it is what I'm actually getting out of this. I'm not getting you know, like a tiramisu has got the, 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 the cinnamon, it's got the coffee in it. I'm not getting any of that, of course, because it's not there. But it's supposed to be a banana parfait. Um, what it actually shows, because you know, it, along with a description, they always have a little picture to go along with. The, the picture is literally, it's basically lined up like a tiramisu with a banana on top. So it's banana pudding with lady fingers is what it looks like in the picture. It clouds well. <laughs> it's really, really creamy. Clouds very well, actually. I like the clouds. This is giving me better clouds than the uh, the black or the carmine was. And this one I can probably actually vape all day. Amber is definitely definitely a good one. I still I can't get too much vanilla out of it, which means to you guys it's going to be spot on for what you're expecting to be a banana unless you're like me and you have a hard time tasting those flavors. But it is damn good. Now, I did get these from XL Vapor. They sent me the Helios line. They sent me the V-God line. V-God V God line I've already done. Um, the only one that I'm not doing out of Helios is, oh, what is it called? Meteor? And that's because it's an RY4. That's the one I was telling you all last time that I went ahead and I piffed to somebody. Just honestly because he's trying to stop smoking. So he still vapes the uh, tobacco flavors and I just can't do the tobacco flavors. That being said, I did take a pull off of the Meteor and it does have a really strong vanilla and a really strong caramel but the tobacco just kills it for me specifically. So I'm vaping this at 60 watts. I've got it built point, uh, point 0.3, so it's right at 4.2 volts. Um, I build there because I like being able to say that this is probably what you're going to get if you're using a brand new battery and a mech mod as well. And there's that dry hit that I was looking for right before the dry hit anyway. So let's move on to the gold. Now the gold just says that it's a kaleidoscope of freshly harvested orchard fruit flavors. Which is honestly kind of scaring me. 
because I don't really know what to expect there. There's a lot of fruits that they grow in orchards. Whole lot of citrus. Whole lot of citrus. So let's see what we get out of it. I'm not quite sure what that is. It does say the very first line. This is never the same taste twice. Wouldn't really give it all that. Those two pulls right there were dead on the same. I'm not sure what it is, honestly. It's really fruity. I do... I do like it. I'm not sure what to pull out of it though. It's like there's a hint of a bunch of different ones in there. And I mean just a hint. It's really, really well blended. I think... I'm getting an orange. Let's try this again. An orange. I'm getting a little bit of a lemon. Getting a little bit of cotton. <laughs> let's let's redrip there. And I'm going with just basic build, basic little bow ties, so it's not holding too much fluid there. There's this other flavor. That's coming through. It's all citrus. And it's kind of starting to make the top of my taste buds raw. I'm not entirely sure what that is. I don't think it's a passion fruit. I don't think it's a dragon fruit. There might see I was thinking I was pulling a mango out of there but I don't think it's mango Hell, I'm not sure I, I honestly can't tell I know I'm pulling out an orange and a lemon but there's something else back there that I just can't pull out. But I love their labeling. I love the fact that there's not coloring in the juices. I like the theme that they're going for. It'd probably be really easy to say. I like just about everything about this juice. And now I've got the hiccups. So yeah, all in all, I'd pick up the entire line, guys. Um, of course, me personally, like I said, I mean, I wouldn't grab the Meteor just because it's an RY4, it's a tobacco flavor. But the entire rest of the line was really nice. Couldn't really do the Carmine because all I got out of that is a watermelon. I still don't know what fruity breakfast cereal they're talking about because I don't get any cereal flavor from it. And I don't know any other kind of cereal that was watermelon flavored. But between all the rest of them, I like them. I like them a lot. So, guys, that's going to wrap up Helios. So, 
coming up, I know I've got a handful of juices that Mount Baker is supposed to send me. They're releasing five new flavors. Got, I believe it's three new flavors that Bamps Galicious is supposed to be sending me. So those will be coming up as well, guys. So with all of that being said, XL Vapes is where I got this from. Of course, go make sure you subscribe at the bottom here. Guys, y'all don't want to sit here and watch me do juice all the time. You want to see hardware a lot. I've got a couple of pieces of hardware that I got to review, but the companies want to see subscribers. They want to see numbers. So if you subscribe, you'll be able to see me be as honest as I am with juice with hardware like I have been in the past. So make sure you go to Facebook, join the uh, Two, Foots, uh, Two Foots Forest Facebook group there, and that way you'll get all of the links that I do reviews to, as well as every Thursday when I do my shows on Vapors TV, you'll be able to get those links and times as well. Um, coming up this Thursday, not only are we doing 330 mils of Bamski, but Bamski is also throwing in skateboards. Real, full-size skateboards. Last, week's they, last week they threw in hats and shirts. So it just keeps getting better on the shows, guys. Make sure you come early. I do have my 8 viewer limit. I'm going to leave it at 8. It's never going to go up. It's never going to go down. But these, vi these vendors, they send out what is basically free money to you guys. And I give it away freely. So all I ask is you come, log in to Vapors.tv. Um, I'm on Cloud Network is the channel that I'm on. And get some free juice, man. Just come hang out. We have a lot of conversations. If I can't answer a question, there's normally a chat full of people that know as much, if not more, than I do. So, guys, I'm going to call it quits for the night. I'm going to go catch up on a couple of shows that I happen to miss. Y'all have a good night. Have fun. Go pick up Helios. Go pick up V-God. Still to this day, the only thing I want you to completely stay away from is the Vapor Shark EG slime. But y'all, have fun.